Well, I think I've already stumbled into plenty of surprises for today, but this next stop is going to surprise almost all of you. All right, so the place we're headed to next is uh, a bit unexpected. No, make that very unexpected. It's often considered one of the hidden gems throughout all of Texas. And uh, just wait till you see what this place looks like inside. Nestled on 200 acres is a concert hall known as Festival Hill. It's impressive from the outside, but here's the real payoff. Wow. Here we are. Here we are. <laughs> this is amazing. I think, Chet, after you traveled, I understand, 150,000 miles over Texas, you finally found the place. This is James Dick, a world-class pianist and visionary who founded the Round Top Festival Institute as a small concert series in homes and on front porches. But then all of a sudden we thought, how can we do larger concerts, orchestra and so on? So the next thing was to think about some kind of a pole barn, maybe. <laughs> well, the pole barn turned into this. <laughs> this is the fanciest pole barn. Well, we built it little by little. There's a musical expression called poco a poco. So we use that as our kind of our genesis to build this hall. That's incredible. It's impressive from the standpoint that wood is used. It's real wood, it's not just veneer. And wood is such a great purveyor of sound. So we're sitting in, in a big kind of musical instrument when we're listening to music. Festival Hill is craftsmanship at its finest and so acoustically wonderful that it attracts musicians from all over the world orchestras, solo acts, choirs. This has become more than just a concert hall. It's a place to connect with architecture, people, and music like nowhere else. I think everything is related to music. I think the rural area, the outdoors, nature. I mean, think of Beethoven. He would, he would walk through the Vienna woods with his little tablet that he would write ideas down. So nature is a very big part of music too. And look at birds, they <laughs> sing. That is an inspiring way to see the world. And James has built a legacy here, inspiring others. Would you play for us? Well, I can a little bit, yes. <laughs> I've, I've done it once Up or here? twice. Yes, sure. Wow, one of the most magical moments on Day Tripper. Thank you. That was beautiful. To see the full episode or to get info about how to visit this spot, trip on over to thedaytripper.com. Or here's some other videos you may like. Via con Dios, amigos.